Today is our second day in Faxe and our plan is not that huge but still very exciting. The story for now, they were calling many taxis, they know, nobody answers, people are celebrating and we decided just to have motorbike from this place, automatic Honda and now we are heading to the center. Yes, Danny? Yes, we are. Here is our babe for today, super new Honda Click. Yeah, pretty happy with this. Uh, 100,000 ton dollars. Yeah, this bike is worth this money. Some gas in and let's get started. the plan just to turn here and go back to the side of friendship mall all this part behind me we walked uh, yesterday like for two three hours we were walking around all these little streets to find the place so let's go to this side so this is the street Danny I told you there are three guest houses so we can go to this little shitty uh, street I mean the street is okay but no real road yeah, yeah. it's just a off-road proper off-road here by the way Ida bakery is quite popular in Foxe if to go down this street you can find guest house and where is one restaurant on the river okay let's stop here uh, people commenting about this place that it's quite nice cheap budget they have different rooms with different prices it's nice yeah, and the point, on the other side. The, the, the point about this is that yeah, you have a river view, not Mekong river view, but river view. If to go this road, you will get to that um, restaurant. I hope the restaurant is still here, they didn't move it. Here is the restaurant, this is how it looks. Inside there is kind of photo zone, you can take nice pictures and the restaurant is huge and before they had live music, they have enough of space for dancing. This is the other river. Now we're heading to Mekong River. Ready, Danny? Yeah. We were driving by this place and the local guy invited us to have a look at the uh, Looks like it's a lot of fun for local people. And by the way, this is how it looks here. And there is one more floating restaurant, floating boat. But it doesn't work. Heading down this dirt road. But so far, we are not sure where we will end up with this. Looks like the end. Yeah. Local man who said, Yeah, you can go, it's okay. Probably this is how they use it themselves. Sabaidi! Sabaidi, local people, local life! Yeah. <laughs> Let me check the map first, where we now actually. Small little alley now. Okay. Super, super local area. Look at this. I think this way. Oh, 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 look at this! My goodness, Benny! You go yourself, it's so steep! There is a little bit of... Cover it. Come on, close. Local, local area. Wooden huts. Not sure which road we should really take. I think this road. This is like kind of proper road. It wasn't in the plan, but the experience was nice. Very, very local place. Local hut, local street. Everything is like authentic, super authentic laws. Yeah, especially now, all the music for celebrating families and friends because of the new year.
really huge, huge, huge plan is to go to that, um, that temple somewhere on the hill. You probably saw a golden Buddha, so we'll try to get there. And as for the temperature at the moment, let me show you. My location says it's 36 degrees, but feels like 42. It's super hot, it's super hot. It says six kilometers and it's kind of mountain road, quite uh, curvy and probably steep. We'll see if we can get there directly or maybe just as close as possible. On that side is high water. I think so, looks like. You wanna check on the map? Okay. We are just taking this um, little street, little road, again quite local uh, because we missed the right turn so we will try to get from this road to the, to the one we need to get to the temple hopefully it's, it's very possible so we need to turn here, yes Building a new temple there Not one of these similar looking houses Mansions, mansions must have the same architect for all these people, they're literally the same pattern. Oh. One more mansion. Taxi millionaires. Honestly, I didn't know about this temple. We just saw the Buddha on the hill and we just came to see the Buddha. Look at this, I don't know, hundreds of thousand golden Buddhas. And also you can find a few small shops with some souvenirs and where is ice cream shop and there are a few cars and motorbikes people are coming to visit. Probably it's not so many people here because first no tourists and second it's super hot. It's 42 degrees. Many people just chilling at home. That's obvious only us. <laughs> Stupid Farank here <laughs> boiling ourselves. Look at this from this side. How gorgeous it is. This is definitely very new temple can't even imagine how many of them here hundred a thousand I checked the name of the temple what goes along and it looks like it's quite famous tourist destination in Paxa because it's good, it's huge, it's super beautiful. The road is good, looks like they were trying their best to make the road so people can come and visit, pray or just enjoy. I'm not sure what it said, but there are numbers like 15 of February 2017, 9 of July 2019, so probably this is the time when it was built, start and end, because as I said, it looks super duper new, and this temple is small inside, like this. There is one more, bigger, and I think it's the main temple. Did you check that area? Yeah, the it's view? a nice viewpoint. Yeah, it's really nice here. You can see how wide the river is over there. Check it out. Look how wide. Not many boats. I haven't really seen boats here. Either. This is the bridge we crossed from that side of Paxa to this side. And look at Paxa. It's big enough. It's really huge. I hope you can see it as I can see. But it's big. Paxi is big. It would be much more beautiful if it's rainy season and everything is green and vibrant, not like now. So we explored the, these two temples. Golden Buddha's here, the viewpoint there, and now we are heading to the big Buddha. Little souvenir shops, some hats, small snacks, ice cream water and more and more people are coming actually then he's getting acquainted with monks i don't know what they're talking about but i've heard no in no, no low no low but they're still kind of talking but look at him oh wow this buddha is like super huge i'm not sure about how the height and the actual size but it looks impressive 
Again, one more viewpoint, sunset time, you can just see it and enjoy this gorgeous view. Oh, it looks being just next to Buddha. There are a few more and these people, I'm not sure what it all means, maybe those who created all of this. I think 2010, so probably 2010 the Buddha was done, 23 meters and 13 meters. Uh, I'm not sure if you can read Lao or you are Lao person, please write it in the comments what it means. But what I think, it says like 23 meters height and 13 meters wide. This is just my guessing, but if I'm wrong, just write it in the comments down below, guys. With the Buddha and temple that's it we've been here for about an hour more than 40 degrees feel myself like a proper chicken in the pot we are going back to the center hopefully we will uh, get to the friendship mall as you can see we're already at the friendship mall with this nice sign i love Paxa. yeah uh, this area was built it's like quite new area and the mall was built like this building now many businesses closed here but it's also like shopping center if to go that street where is a morning or night market I am not sure I don't remember so this is like very proper shopping area in in Paxa let's get inside the mall oh here is the mall the aircon oh finally look how cute it is Danny, you like it? Nice, yeah. Colourful, all fake flowers though. Plastic flowers. But still beautiful. This mall is not that huge, but at the same time it's uh, big enough. It has two floors. It has some food courts, some stuff for kids, some just clothes, cosmetics. I think it's a nice photo area because now New Year it's all about flowers and water and refreshment in nature. So and here we have food court. Get one of these bikes. Go to the Bolivian Plateau. You think one of them? so? I think so. So you will you will drive Honda Creek and I will drive this one, right? Hundred <laughs> percent. Good idea. Thank you, Danny. There are even elevators here. Oh, food, food, sushi. Mm. Okay, I'm coming back for sushi. Kids area. Market, but probably with uh, more or better choices because it's so close to Thailand. Actually, as Vientiane is, honestly, I feel myself in Paxa more like in Thailand than in Laos. The mall itself, um, not so many shops, but the choice good enough. And the prices in Paxa for the clothes and for some brand good quality things also not very expensive. Good choice of. Uh, traveling bags, sport bags. Also they have Nike, they have Echo. You see the boxes. I'm not sure if it's 100% authentic, but I want to believe in that because prices are like for authentic things. <laughs> yeah, 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 rock and roll. Danny, maybe you really need to buy one. I think I'd grow my hair like this within a week anyway. Really? That's it. How did I? 25,000, two and a half dollars for a new hair. Danny, it's a good deal. Yeah. Take it, buy it. I'm not sure about the black. Don't miss your chance. What's Don't miss your chance. Color? But look, they have green and yellow and orange. They've and... got purple. I like purple. You like purple? Okay, let's try to find purple I'm for fine. you. Time for food. Let's see what we can get at this 
food for barbecues like this you can see the prices two three five thousand and those for people go oops and here is what Rita came for sushi Tadai three three thousand one this 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 three thousand Okay, good deal. Sounds good. Let's try um, one of each. Mm -hmm. Let's start here. Start here. Is that one. bacon? Looks like bacon. Yeah, looks like mm. bacon. One, two, like very proper tail. Tail of the fish there. Three. Shrimp. Four. Five. Cheese. Lao style sushi. Yeah, very, very proper Lao style. Let's feed one more here. Seven. Up. Oh, this is like seafood sushi. The bill is fifty. I think it's a good deal. And we have oh, like this. Put uh, seventeen sushis. Danny, what was looking at you? The cream. Bowl of cream in the fridge. Oh yeah, I know it's not real cream. That's the thing. Well, Danny, he is trying his best not to buy anything here, just to buy some barbecue meat. That's right. My uh, dinner will be bit roast chicken, some duck maybe, and some chicken ass. Oh wow! It sounds even better than my sushi. You said you like chicken ass. I like chicken feet, not ass. Oh right. It's different, Danny. It's even in different parts of chicken. Come. <laughs> This is very new central part of Paxe. That way there is a bridge, Mekong, and here shopping is all on this street. Then he found what he wanted, barbecue oh chicken. So we asked, she said this big chicken, 40,000. Oh, one second, it's okay to, to film. Put, I put back and I can. Okay. This is how it looks when you are a blogger. Put it back and let's start from the very beginning. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's quite noisy right now. Music is playing from every corner. I am assuming this is morning local market. And it's huge. Look, it's very, very big. And it's like, ooh, further there. Only very few shops still open. Tons of eggs. I wonder how fast they sell it because I don't think they put it in the fridge every night. Some dry fish. Oh my goodness. Yum, yum, yum. Chili. Something what I don't know. Any? you happy with your tomatoes and cucumber? Not a cucumber and tomatoes. Chicken pork. Pretty happy. So hungry now. <laughs> Cannot wait to get back and eat. Yeah, let's go. Which way we go? We, oh, we should go this way. Came back to the hotel, to the resort, to our beautiful nature, palm trees, and this sound. And just listen for a few seconds. Listen. It's just amazing. So, that's it for today. We went to the temple, as you saw. We went to the shopping mall. We had a ride through the city, through the new part of the Paxe city. Hope you enjoyed that. We did. And see you next time. Bye.